my birthday's in five days. For those who can't make it to me, my cash app is this. Anything is fine. Thanks. Update. Ugh, I see that a lot of you all liked this yesterday, but no one dropped anything in my cash app. Let's try it again. If I tagged you, that means I consider you a friend. Let's make it happen. No, this is not how you get money at any point in time ever. The fact that you even consider this a viable option to exploit your friends for money is so ridiculously trashy. I, I can't even imagine that you'll have friends after posting like this. Like, dude, people just aren't going to give you their money. And if they are, they'll do it willingly, not because you pressured them into giving them money. And if pressuring them into giving them money does actually work, just know that they're probably not going to talk to you anymore. What's going on, Modern Chodes? It's your boy, Long Nail, back again with another new video. And in today's video, we're going over the hot posts from r slash trashy. Let's get into it. Imagine thinking your spouse's job defines you. Army wife. <laughs> I could just imagine this like, oh, stay at home wife. <laughs> like, dude, well, why are you getting this tattooed on your arm? I get it. You're proud and it's your body. You do what you want. But this is just a little over the top, don't we think? This is how little kids cough. Oh, look, it's the chick from my last video. Or maybe it was two videos ago where she just absolutely tormented this poor Uber driver because he asked her to wear a mask. Look at that. It totally fits. She does act like a little kid. Top posts. Human poop. Yep, this should be interesting. There's been someone pooping into plastic grocery bags and spreading them throughout our neighborhood for years now. I posted about this before. Well, I just got home from vacation to two bags of human waste in my yard. Well, not only that, but my dogs got into it and are throwing up human feces in my house. I am so beyond livid. The ops haven't done anything. I'm either testing for DNA with an internet kit or setting up cameras for 24 seven monitoring of our street so that this ends. Once we catch this person, they're getting sued. Yeah, th this is literally trashy. And also, I think this chick doesn't understand how those tests work. Like these DNA tests, unless you have a full database, which I have no idea how you'd have access to that. This is not going to give you any reliable info. You're not going to be able to match the DNA to anybody. But uh, I get what you're going through here. I would also be extremely livid and I would probably want to do the same thing. So I'll cut you some slack. And to whoever this grocery bag poop artist is, all I have to ask is why? <laughs> why are you doing this? My wife, who's 29, aborted our baby over astrology. Yep, that's right. She did it because a child would be a Sagittarius. I'm upset because we were trying for a child. My wife and I have been married for about three years. Ah, so what you're saying is, you were only married for three years. Like if I got married to somebody and they pulled this after you guys intentionally got pregnant, uh, this is just so ridiculous, dude. Like, oh, oh, you know, like yeah, the month they're gonna be born in, I, I just, I can't deal with that. They're gonna be a bad child. N no, they wouldn't have been, but you didn't even give them that chance, which uh, if I was this dad, I would just, yeah, I would leave to say it. Simply enough, especially if it's over something as ridiculous as this star sign or whatever. Yeah, that's just, <laughs> that's a no-go for me, dog. Dinosaurs are not real. Read the Bible. Mm, yep, that's enough. You need to see me. <laughs> uh, for some reason, I feel like the kid definitely isn't the one who filled that out. Hmm, it's almost like, I don't know, somebody implanted that idea into their head. Oh man, you just, for some reason, people just can't accept that science exists. And who's to say that, oh, God and the dinosaurs don't exist. Like, but, but we have full proof of one of them. So the fact that they're teaching it shouldn't bug you. 
uh, it makes no sense. There's literal proof that the dinosaurs existed. Video footage has surfaced of the same troublemaking Uber passenger seen earlier in this video who was messing with the driver in the video, but now it's another dude and it's still the same people. And they're still, guess what? Just messing with a different driver. Yeah, clearly these people are entitled little spoiled brats that think they can do whatever they want and get away with it. And now that there's multiple videos out there of them doing this kind of stuff, I hope not only do they get banned from Uber, but you know, they get some other sort of repercussion aside from, oh, I have to use Lyft now. Because honestly, they're not gonna learn their lesson until actually somebody does something about it. One star, worst school ever. Teachers are always beating up the students. The students themselves have no discipline, always fighting and beating. The teachers are also not good. They don't teach well. Response from the owner. Shut up before I beat you also. <laughs> okay, this this has to be fake. I've never seen reviews of schools, not that I've looked, but if I did see them, I definitely wouldn't imagine it being like this. Uh, like there has to be somebody that could go in here and just delete these sort of reviews because this is clearly just some, I don't know, whatever. This is, there's no way this is real. Ah, uh, yet another trashy tattoo. For some reason, people just really don't think these things through. Audi, with the four rings on the other hand. Yeah, you could have just got a necklace or something that, that symbolizes you like Audi. But also, if you were going to get a tattoo, you should probably go to somebody, I don't know, that didn't just learn how to write yesterday. Dude, this tattoo is so bad. That not only is the concept of the tattoo terrible, but the execution of the tattoo is equally as bad, if not worse. Guys, if you're going to get a permanent tattoo, again, permanent tattoo, save up and spend the money on somebody who actually knows what they're doing, because again, it's permanent. You want it to look good. This is one thing that you simply don't cheap out on. There's only one problem. What's that? I'm married. So why are you even texting me? There is no romance. She hasn't touched me in ages. Uh, if she doesn't want you, what makes you think I will? Goodbye, sir. Ah, what a classy person and a trashy person. I think we all know who's who here. Dude, if you're really that unhappy, how about you express that to them? And then if you try and they don't reciprocate or you guys can't work it through, oh, well, guess what? Oh, we got to break it off. And then you start sending these messages to people. But if you ever have to tell somebody, oh, by the way, I'm married, you're doing something wrong. Be without clothes at my sister's wedding. My sister is having an outdoor wedding in May. I want someone to have no clothes in the woods and run through the wedding in order to ruin it. I'll pay you and protect you from my family. Lots of money here. Why would you do this? The, the, you're intentionally trying to ruin the wedding? I, I, like You could have at least, at least been clever enough to lie and go like, oh, it's for a joke. It's the vibe our family has. It happened at my wedding and I think it'd be hilarious to continue it on. No, no, no. You just blatantly go, oh, yeah, I'm kind of a scumbag. And, yep, I just want to ruin their wedding. Bro, you suck. Little $1,400. Mobby's little stim stim. Wow, if that's the only reason you're having children is so you can get money from them, from the government, I think you're probably better off not having children. Not something I would often say to people. But seriously, if the only reason you're having a child is for a paycheck, Please, don't have a child. All right, Modern Chodes, that's it for the hot posts from r slash trashy. If you enjoyed the video, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications. And of course, share this video with your friends. If you want to help support the channel for free, anytime you have any shopping to do on Amazon, just click the link in the description down below. Do your shopping as regular. It won't cost you anything extra, and it'll help support the channel. So I'd really appreciate it. Till next time, peace.